Hello guys, welcome back to my channel Kerja Data Online. In this video, I'm going to explain and give you an idea about how to interface your Arduino Uno with the TEMT6000 ambient light sensor. So this is the sensor that you can uh, buy from the Spark Fund, and you can also read an article written by the Spark Fund for this particular project and also how to interface with your Arduino Uno. So let me explain the way to connect it. So this is the TEMT6000 consists of three pin uh, which is we call it as the out, ground and also VCC. So the way to interface it is just simply using the three wire over here. You can see the S is correspond to the signal. So the S are going to be attached at the AO of our Arduino Uno. So the AO is actually our ADC, Analog Digital Converter. And then we have the G over there. So the G are going to be attached um, specifically to our Arduino Uno ground, which is the blue color wire over there. And then the V, uh, which is the VCC, are going to be attached at the 3.3 volt. Uh, during my uh, read up from the SparkFun article, we find out that the sensor can tolerate 3.3. 3 until 5 volt and then the maximum tolerate of the voltage will be the 6 volt so for this project or this experiment uh, let me just use the 3.3 for the sake of the example so we finish discussing the interfacing of this uh, hardware uh, with our Arduino Uno let us go into the programming part of it so this is the program adapted from the uh, spark fund so the first one we are actually uh, need to define our light sensor pin uh, at the AO and then followed by the void setup where we uh, specify the pin mode as the light sensor pin as the input and then initialize our serial monitor and then you can follow uh, until the void loop over here where we create two kind of float so the first float is basically reading up the uh, analog read function for that particular AO which is the light sensor pin and then we are going to initialize the another float which is uh, correspond to the square ratio of the particular reading uh, with the 1023 this is the number of the steps uh, according to the ADC exists in our Arduino Uno and then we are going to sum up everything into the square ratio by using the power function and then we are going to uh, print the reading uh, using the serial print ln so let us just uh, upload the code so as usual before you upload the code make sure that you choose the correct board and also uh, correct com port so let me just open up the serial monitor after this and observe the change uh, based on this particular um, programming um, of the sketch so let me just uh, move around a little bit um, for our sensor module and then we are going to wait for a while until the compilation is finished and the code are being uploaded into our Arduino Uno ladies and gentlemen the sketch is already being uploaded into our Arduino Uno so let us uh, open the serial monitor over there so when I open the serial monitor we can see the reading is already begin uh, to be um, produced by our um, sensor and then I'm going to manipulate uh, the sensor by just um, make a sheet or uh, disturb the light exposure from my camera over there uh, on this particular project and then um, I'm going to disturb it a little bit here and there you can see there is a significant change of the light value so remember this is not a lux value it is not being calibrated yet it's just a simple um, ambient light uh, indicator which is indicate um, a very high intensity of light exposed and also the low intensity light exposed so even if i move around um, away from my camera you can see this is the normal conditions of my light um, inside my um, area or inside my room and then if I uh, put it back uh, on the high intensity light uh, in front of the camera that you can see over here uh, it's indicate a very high reading so when we close it a little bit when we make a shade when we try to cover the sensor so the sensor are going to be uh, reduce its output significantly so in a summary we successfully use the TEMT 600 TEMT 6000 ambient light sensor and you can read up more applications in the descriptions of uh, this particular video and um, in conclusion we successfully interface it like this video please do help me with this three click by click the like icon over there make a comment down there share to your friend and family and do subscribe 
and hit those notification bell so you will not miss our future update until then thank you very much for watching and see you again bye bye